In bioinformatics, coordinates tell us where something sits on the genome. A one-base system counts from one, that is the first base in position one. A zero-base system numbers between the nucleotides. For the one-base coordinate system, single nucleotides vary in positions or ranges are specified directly by their corresponding nucleotide numbers, whereas for the zero-base coordinate system, single nucleotides vary in positions and ranges are specified by the coordinates that flank them. In a one-base coordinate system, deletions are labeled right where the deleted bases are, and insertions are shown between the bases that flank the new insertion. But in zero-base system, deletions are marked by the coordinates that surround the deleted bases, and insertions are placed exactly at the coordinates where the new bases appear. So who uses what? The BET files, BAM files, and BCF files are all zero-based, that is half open, which means the start is inclusive and the end is exclusive, whereas the VCF, GTF, GFF, SAM files are all one-based. UCSC stores internally as zero base but shows one base, whereas Ensemble and NCBI use one base across the board. Why it matters? Imagine you have ChIP-seq peaks in a BED file like this. You now want to check which gene features from a GTF file these peaks overlap. Now, if your code directly compares the BED start to the GTF start, without adjusting, it will think the peak starts before the exon, even though biologically the peak perfectly aligns with the exon. In order to fix this, always convert your coordinates to the same system and check the format before intersecting files. Hit subscribe for more shots that decode bioinformatics one concept at a time.